I heard that Kansas City, you know, they have a great barbecue restaurants here. Welcome to JoJo TV. Hi guys, welcome to another episode of Flight Attendant Layover Vlog. On today's episode, we are here in Kansas City, Missouri. I already got my workout done this morning. Look at that, I'm very productive. I did some journaling. By the way, I started to carry my little notebook not look so little. We arrived last night around uh, 10 o'clock-ish. And of course, it's super late, so I didn't really get to do anything last night, but just pretty much sleep and rest. I was actually surprised that I fell asleep super fast. Like, I was planning on um, listening to this audiobook, and I think I only listened to it for about 5 to 10 minutes, and then I passed out. <laughs> I, like, fall asleep because I don't remember anything about it, so... I feel like I slept like super, super fast last night. But anyways, um, it is so cold here in Kansas City, you guys. We checked the weather, my husband and I checked the weather before you know this trip and it was supposed to be around 45, I don't know, 45 to 55, something like that. So I had my coat with me this morning or yesterday morning and I decided to leave it in my car because I'm like, it's less, you know, one, one less thing for me to carry and now i wish i have it because it's not around 45 to 55 now the weather is around 32 to 50 i think it's the the warmest that's gonna get today so right now it's about 40 degrees outside and it's only 2 30 in the afternoon so we're gonna meet at three o'clock today that's in about 30 minutes at the lobby and today we are going to have a barbecue <laughs> i heard that kansas city you know they have a great barbecue restaurants here one of the pilots actually recommended us to go to this restaurant that i'm going to show you later when we go to because i forgot the name of it and uh, he said this is one of the best barbecue restaurants here in the area so we're going to go there i think we're going to uber because it's about three miles plus and he recommend not to walk. So I'm like, okay, we're gonna do that. just got back here in my room that was such a beautiful night with my colleagues i had such a great time so getting to the place we actually uber and it took about 10 minutes to get there uh, with uber coming back <laughs> we 
walked, you guys. We walked. Such a beautiful night. It was a 40 minute walk, you guys. <laughs> to be honest with you, I thought it was like, oh my God, that's kind of far to walk. It actually felt great. My colleague borrowed me her light coat and I'm so thankful that she did because I wouldn't be able to walk. It was pretty cold, so. It is around 45 degrees, so it's still kind of cold. You still kind of need to, to wear some sort of like a uh, coat. And this is all I got, pretty much. I try to layer as much as I can, but I still needed, you know, something to keep me warm. So she borrowed me her coat. That was so nice of her. So I made it. And by the time we actually got to the hotel, I thought, I'm like, really that was already 40 minutes it was less than two miles i thought it was three miles but we kind of just took our time we were just chatting and really enjoying our walk beautiful sunset i didn't really see exactly like the actual sun but the the glow of the sunset it's so beautiful and what else we saw just pretty much this there's not a lot of people on the road we were kind of like surprised it looks like a ghost town it's just us walking <laughs> and that's it we had such a great time the restaurant you guys it's called arthur bryant's it's amazing you can't judge it by how it looks outside it just looks just like a regular restaurant that it doesn't seem like it's gonna have like such a great food and it's really like super simple that i'm like is this a restaurant it looks like a just like cafeteria like tables and you pretty much sit your own. We got there, huge line. And by the time we get to the line, even got bigger lines. And I didn't know how big the serving of the full rack. <laughs> I think I should have an idea of what it is, but I forgot, you know, I haven't had the ribs for a while. So I ordered the uh, full rack of ribs, pork ribs, and oh my goodness, it was the size of the tray and i was so surprised but i didn't want to put it back i'm like all right i'll just take it home for papa and i immediately immediately remove half of it and put it in the uh container so i won't eat it because i know i could totally make some damage in that i could totally finish the whole thing <laughs> if i want to but i wanted to save some for papa so he can also try it and I pretty much pack at least three quarters of the fries. I really just ordered it. I thought it was going to be small. I ordered half portion of it, but I got like a big <laughs> portion of French fries. And there's some bread on the bottom, like a sliced bread. I didn't even eat the sliced bread. Uh, and I just, I was just, I had like enough food to eat. Also bought like the sauces, three different kinds of sauces. And I am in love with all of them. They all kind of have a different flavor in it. And sometimes I like the other one better than the other, but I think I like all of them uh, almost equally because you know, you get, you get to try a different flavor while you're eating. And I actually even use the sauces for dippings for my French fries. So I really enjoyed eating it. I don't eat a lot of French fries. I really prefer sweet potato fries, but for some reason, not a lot of really I can really find sweet potato fries for almost everywhere I go. It's really hard to find it. But anyways, you guys, I'm gonna end the vlog here. I had such a great time with my colleagues. They're super cool. Uh, I, I just love them. I really enjoy their company. They're super sweet. They are so nice to me and they are just very, very friendly. I felt like they're my friends already. And I already felt like We've been working together for forever. So I had such a great time. The other flight attendant, she actually ended up uh, not joining us because she went out with her friend. I truly enjoy this layover in Kansas City, Missouri. I love it. All right, you guys, if you are still here and if you do like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And remember to share this video with that's right, with someone you love. 
<laughs> if you want to see more videos like this, please consider subscribing to my YouTube channel. <laughs> you know, Jojo TV. Thank you very much for your time. Maraming salamat po. Mwah! You know that life's a magic circle And it's my turn for a ride I'm dusting out this bubble And I'm flying on the side You can sit down with your trouble Back from me, it's plain to see This is my look, my life, my love This is my destiny